Patrick Tuttle, the real estate guy with Legacy Real Estate Services in El Paso, Texas. And here we are with FAQ Friday for Friday the 24th of February. Happy birthday, Hannah. Yes, it's your birthday, sweetie. That's my daughter, by the way. Um, so we've got a couple of questions for you. Today, James asks, should I invest a lot in improvements of the home before selling it? Well, James, good question. Uh, what I would advise you to do is let's get one of our stagers over there. It could be my lovely wife, Raja. It could be Nani. And let's take a look at what your home has to offer compared to the competition. Now, what we know, and if you saw my uh, market update back on the 6th of uh, February, if you saw my market update, you'll see the difference between what the per square foot price that a builder gets for their home versus the average resale home in El Paso. And that gap is huge. You can see as much as 20 bucks a square foot difference between a resale home and a new home. So the builders are getting a higher price per square foot because they've got the nicer, newer features in their properties. And typically that translates into a faster sale and more money, more profit in their pockets. I'm a big advocate of making sure that your home shows the best, but we also have to be cognizant of the fact that you have a budget that you need to invest with, so we need to see what we can do to get the best bang for your buck. So, should you do improvements? Probably, but a lot of that depends on what you've already got in the property. So give us a call at 585-7777 and we'll be happy to have Nani and Raja come out and give a staging consultation and let you know whether or not it needs to change pink for mica to granite, for example. All right, so now on to the next question. And Kim, Kim asks, how do I search for the best lender? Kim, great question there. I'm a huge believer that the best lenders, realtors, whatever it is, come from referrals. So if you know somebody personally that's gotten a mortgage and was happy with the service that they received, then ask them what they liked about that lender. If you don't, call me. I'll be happy to put you in touch with one of our great lender partners here at Legacy Real Estate Services. We've got some fantastic ones, but a lot of that depends on what your needs are, what kind of price range you're in, whether you're doing a VA loan, a conventional loan, an FHA loan, or maybe even a hard money loan. But we've got lenders for all people here at Legacy Real Estate Services. We've got the connections that you need. And that's it for today's question. So if you've got a question you'd like for me to answer on an upcoming episode of FAQ Fridays, just shoot me an email, Patrick at PatrickTuttle.com. Drop me a line in the comments right below or give me a call, 915-585-7777, and we'd be happy to answer your questions in an upcoming episode of FAQ Friday. So also, if you like what we're doing here, like it and share it on Facebook and YouTube so that we can spread the word and we can help more people. Thanks for watching, God bless you, and make it a great day. Bye-bye.